What is up my beautiful nine family? Welcome back. This video is called affiliate marketing 110% done for you. And I really mean that we are going to give you all the tools you need to be a successful affiliate marketer selling high ticket products that are already converting to people that already want them. So if you want something that is a little bit more structured, something that that'll make you money faster, this video is for you. So let me just paint a picture really quickly about what we're going to do. Okay. So you're going to send people to this page. You're like, how do I send people to them? Well, you're going to create a Facebook ad, which I'm going to walk you through step by step by step how to create this Facebook ad. And the ads are right here. I'm going to give you the ads. I'm going to show you what to write in the ads. I'm going to show you who to target. I'm going to do all of that thing. It's all done for you. Then you're going to send them to this page right here. Sorry, wrong page. Uh, sorry, wrong page. This page right here, they're going to enter in their email address. Okay. Let's say I enter in my email address. Okay. Then they're going to get to this page right here. So this page will come up. This is a webinar. Okay. So this webinar converts at 30 times of any sales page that we have. Okay. 30 times better rate of a conversion. So if they come to this page, they are very likely to purchase. Then what's going to happen is they're going to watch this video. They're going to want to purchase most lots of them are going to want to purchase. Okay. So then they're going to click this button right here. This button, we are going to embed your affiliate code, which is your magic link that is going to grant you 31% commissions, which is how you make your money. And by the way, I don't, I don't know if I mentioned this, I'm going to give you, I'm going to give you all of this for free, right? This page is going completely done, given to you. I'm just going to send you this funnel. Okay. So you're going to, they're going to click this button. They're going to go to this checkout page. They're going to pay $1,997. You are going to get out your calculator and realize that 31% of $1,997 is like $600. So every single time you get a sale, you're going to make at least $600 from selling this. And then we have, we have two programs, so you can probably double that up, which is crazy, right? So that's cool. Then you're probably thinking, what else, Kale? How is this 110% done for me? Okay, well, remember this page back here, guys? This first page where, I, where we asked them for their email address? Well, we did that for a reason. We did that so that we can follow up with people, okay? And you're probably thinking, what do I send to follow up with them? Because not everybody's gonna buy the first time, right? They're not gonna, they're not gonna purchase. But what if you could follow up and make sure that all those people that didn't buy the first time had an opportunity to buy later and probably will buy later, right? So I wrote all of the emails for you, okay? So not university affiliate marketing, 110% done for you. So here's all the emails. Look at how long this is, guys. It's 19 pages long. Like I don't know what to tell you, but but it's kind of insane. You can get this for free if you click the link below. And I'm going to show you how to set up all of the emails using a autoresponder that is affiliate marketing friendly, unlike the one that I did in that other video. Sorry if you watch that other video. Drip isn't exactly affiliate marketing friendly, sorry. But I'm going to show you how to set it up in one that is, and we're going to get it all set up right here, right now. So settle in. I'm going to show you how to do this. This might not be the least complicated video I've ever filmed, but it is going to be the most profitable for you if you actually follow the steps. Okay, so you're probably thinking to yourself, Kale, what the heck did you just say? What, what is going on? So let's just break it down. Okay. So the first step, the very first step, all you have to do guys is go to www.9university.com. Okay. So you go here and you're going to sign up as an affiliate. So you click this button right here and you sign up. I think I'm already logged in. So it might not take me to the correct screen. Okay. Yeah, it didn't. It, it didn't take me to the correct screen. So you're just going to have to enter some information in there. That's fine. But once you get to this screen, this is where this is Emily's account. She's an employee of ours. That's why she hasn't made any money. But um, if you want to see some people that have made some money, this is one of our students. He's making $2,363 in the past seven days. Um, last 30 days, he made $6,700 doing exactly what I'm teaching you right here. Okay. Um, this is our sales. Like if you want to see like $666,000, if you want 31% of that, um, this is, this is where you can do that. Okay. And so you're in there. Where did I get that? Where is that page? Okay. So you're in this account and now you're going to be like, okay, where do I get my affiliate link? How do I get my links? Your links are down here. So you pick whichever, whichever thing you're selling, you're selling the Amazon course, you're selling the Facebook ads course. Let's focus on those two for this video. Okay. So you just click, get my links. 
And this is where you get your links. Sorry guys, I'm just trying to, I got all these emails popping up, it's crazy. So this is, this is where you get your links. You can click here, you can change it. The link you're probably gonna use is this Nine University Facebook Ads landing page link, and then it's going to give you your link maybe. Yep, there it is. Okay, so there's your link and you just copy this link. And that's where, if anyone clicks on this link, they buy from you, right? So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is get the funnel that I'm giving to you guys for free, which is down here, right? This is the, these are the funnels and I'll show you, there's actually gonna be two of them. So when you go into ClickFunnels on your page, you'll only have these first two funnels right here, okay? Affiliate Facebook ads and affiliate Amazon FBA, right? So pick the product you wanna sell first. Let's just assume you wanna sell affiliate Facebook ads, okay? So click affiliate Facebook ads, and then when it takes you to this page, you're gonna go in here to the thank you page, which is the second page, and the only thing you have to edit, because everything else is done for you, is you just click edit page, and you take that link that you just copied over from your affiliate page, and you go and you click this button, and you click set action, and then you change that link to your affiliate link, right? You see this link is in here now? This is your affiliate link. So now every time someone watches this video and clicks this button, then you make money, right? It's really, 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 really simple. Same thing right here, um, change this one to your affiliate link. So you click this link and they make money and it gets really, really easy. And the coolest thing is they're going right to this right away. So you're able to send them to the biggest sales pitch right away. And so, that's pretty much it for that page. That's the thing you need to set up initially to make sure people are clicking there. And I'm gonna, we're gonna come back to this in a second when we're setting up your Facebook pixel, okay? And so then you're gonna wanna create your ads and you're probably thinking, how do I get my ads? What do I do? So to get your ads, you go down here, let's start over, um, get my resources. So to get your resources, you go in here and then you click on grab your nine university affiliate marketing resources, right? And so these resources are all right here for you to go. I actually made a folder called 110% done for you. Okay. And now you're going to click on nine U Facebook ads or whichever one you want to sell. And here's two ads. One of them is a Facebook ad and one of them is an Instagram ad, right? So you just download the ad and then you're able to use that in the ad that we are going to create next. Cool. You guys with me? You guys with me? Okay. I'm going to show you how to create the Facebook ad, but the, but the very first thing you need to do, if you want to make money like this, if you want to make um, see, we made, we spent $50,000 and we made $495,000 from that spend. If you want to make money like that on Facebook ads, the first thing that you need to do is get your pixel set up correctly. So this is really, really easy. Get your Facebook ad account rolling, go up here to this and go up to pixels. Okay. And so we need, we need to install your pixel on the proper pages so that we can track the people that are going to them so that you can track your cost of acquiring a lead for affiliate marketing. Okay, so I'm just gonna click into this account so I can show you guys what the heck is going on. Um, okay, so you're in here and you're looking at your pixel and you're like, what do we do? So you just go to set up, go to set up right here and then you manually install the pixel yourself. Okay, so you're gonna copy this entire pixel code right here, step number two, just copy the entire pixel code and paste it in the website header. And you're probably like, oh my gosh, there's code, I'm freaking out, how do I do this? Well, don't freak out, it's gonna be easy, okay? I promise, just like, trust me. Go back to ClickFunnels. Uh, I got so many windows open up here now. Okay, so you're gonna go back to ClickFunnels and it's going to look like this, okay? You're gonna be on your first, you're gonna be on your page and it's gonna look like this, exactly like this. So the first thing you do is you go up to the first step of the funnel, you just click right here, then you click on edit page, okay? Now you're gonna go in and you're gonna hit settings, you're gonna hit tracking code, and you're going, it's already in here for me, but you're gonna take that code that we just copied and you're gonna hit, you're gonna paste it right here. So you just paste it in there and then you go up here and you click save. Okay, I'm not gonna save it because it's already in there, um, but we're good to go, okay? Same thing with every page. So do it with this one too, edit page, then you go up there, you go up to settings, tracking, sorry, not that, settings, tracking code, and then you're gonna go and you're going to do this. Paste your code right there and then you're gonna click save, okay? I'm not gonna do it because I don't wanna mess up the page. Same thing, guys, on this page right here. So you click down to this one, you click edit page, and now you're just gonna go up here, two settings, tracking code, and paste your code, okay? So that one wasn't on there, so now the code is on that page. Amazing, okay? Now, all I need to do is set up, now that this is all good to go and it's set up, I need to set up a custom conversion. A custom conversion is just saying, hey, Facebook, something happened that I wanted to happen. Something went down on a website that I wanted to happen. And so this custom conversion that you're setting up is acquiring a lead. Okay. So you're going to go in here to your Facebook ads account, go to custom conversions. Okay. And now you can see I have a bunch of custom conversions set up here if this ever loads. Okay. So we're in our custom conversions. Now we're just going to create a custom conversion. 
We're gonna go here to um, the URL contains and we're gonna pop in the URL of where we want people to go, okay? So if we go back to our page, we go back to this page and this is the page. If people go to this page, that means that they've given us their email address, right? Because you can't see this page unless you go to this, unless you go through this, which is a lead page, right? So you're gonna click this arrow right here and you're gonna pop up whatever this URL is. So you take this URL and now you're gonna go back to go back to Facebook ads and you're gonna pop in this URL right here, okay? Now you're gonna say, all right, what are we gonna call this? We're gonna call this webinar conversion um, test for affiliates, okay? I just wanna make sure that, that I, I don't get confused on my own Facebook ads account, right? And so then we're gonna call it a complete registration, perfect. And now we're gonna hit create. And now, now that that's done, we can test it out. So all you have to do to test it out, guys, is go to your page, wherever that page is, right here, and just load it up. So we loaded it up. I actually have this pixel helper up here, which tells me that the pixels were fired. You guys can download that pixel if you want to. If not, no worries. Come back to custom conversions and load this page and see if that custom conversion worked. So as you guys can see, that worked really perfectly. Look, it says it was active in the last minute and we got someone to sign up for that, that pixel. So that's really amazing because now guys, you're gonna be able to track and train Facebook to find people who are more likely to go to this page. And it's gonna be amazing when you see how powerful this is, okay? So now that we have that set up, we have that conversion set up, we can start making our Facebook ad. It's really, really simple. So you're gonna go up here to Events Manager. You're in Events Manager and then you're gonna go to Cut, um, sorry, back to your ads manager. Sorry guys. Okay, so we're in our ads manager. Okay, so now we're gonna go to create an ad and then we're gonna do a conversion ad. Okay, so we're gonna hit conversions right here and we're going to go down and we're just gonna name this conversions Facebook ads course, okay? Facebook ads course, boom, conversions. Okay, so now we're gonna set this up, all of this stuff that we've talked about in other videos. I'm gonna go through it pretty quickly because there is a lot on our channel about picking targeting, about figuring out who you're gonna run the ads to. There's also an entire course that you can buy below that teaches you how to find the best audiences to run these ads to. So I don't wanna get too detailed, too crazy into this, but I would probably create a couple ad sets right here, create multiple new ad sets, create a conversion event, and the conversion event we want is affiliate. What did I call it? I forget what I called it. Okay, yeah, whatever you called it, Make sure you, you optimize for the conversion, right? And now for the custom audience, guys, I would keep it very simple um, for, for your first few tests, but um, a lot of the audiences that work really well are famous entrepreneurs like Gary Vaynerchuk, um, and then I would split test that with, you know, Tony Robbins, or eh, probably not Tony Robbins. Um, what's that other guy's name? Grant Cardone is another great one. Um, Grant Cardone, doo -doo -doo, Cardone. Um, there's an audience for passive income that people are in, people that are interested in passive income. And guys, there's I'm I'm literally just showing you the bare minimum here. You guys can easily go go into other videos on our channel and learn more about this. You can narrow these audiences down. You could say people that are interested in Gary Vee and interested in Facebook advertising. Like Facebook advertising is you can actually target that. Like that's pretty crazy. You can go in and do crazy stuff. Like you could only target males and females interested in Facebook advertising who haven't been to Guatemala. Like you you guys get it, right? You can really focus this targeting. I don't want this to be a targeting video. So I would just play around with this guys, figure out what is getting you leads for a good price and then go from there. But obviously you wanna focus on people that would be interested in Facebook ads or would be interested in Amazon FBA. If you need more information on this, there's a lot of links in the bio, okay? And so as you're, you just target your ads, you send them out to the right people. Um, for placements, you're gonna do two separate ones. So the first one you're gonna do is Facebook feeds only. So get rid of all the feeds, get rid of everything and just do Facebook feeds and use the ad. So if you're in your dashboard right here, use this ad for Facebook feeds and then use this ad for Instagram. Cause you can see this one is square, this one is for Instagram. See, this one is made specifically for Instagram. So use the one that is for um, Facebook feeds, right? And so we're in Facebook feeds. We're gonna we're gonna say conversions, lowest cost. You're gonna set your budget. When you're setting your budget, guys, make sure you set a budget that you're comfortable with, right? So if you don't have a lot of money, set it for five dollars a day per ad set. So like if you have, I don't know, um, four ad sets here. I got four going right now, so I would set it for twenty dollars, which is five dollars per day per ad set, right? And then you hit continue, and you get to this screen, and then you hit continue again. Okay, so now you're on this screen. You have all your ad sets set up. You can go back and name your ad sets later, that's no big deal. To set up the ad itself, you're just gonna hit single video, 
and you're going to pop that ad in that you downloaded. So I downloaded it here, Facebook ads done for you. You just download the video that you got from your dashboard, you get it for free. You, you download the video and then you're gonna write your ad copy. So I haven't really written the ad copy out yet, guys. I might write it if I'm feeling generous. If I'm feeling generous, it will be here in the link of all the other emails that you're getting. I'll write the ad copy in for you and you'll just copy and paste, literally just copy and paste this ad copy into the text of where you wanna pop it. But seriously, guys, it's not that hard. You're just trying to grab attention. You're saying, stop, Facebook ads training. I wouldn't actually use the words Facebook ads in your ads because we figured out that those, um, those words triggered Facebook to not allow them to be approved. So use something else like advertising help, social media advertising help, you know, like a, a catchy one liner. And then we could go for days about how to write engaging ad copy. Like there is a lot of stuff to it. I'll probably just write it for you guys and put it up here. But um, if you, if you, if you're interested and you want to learn more about this, guys, this is so lucrative. I would honestly consider joining the Facebook ads course that you're promoting because you're going to be able to make back the money that you, using Facebook ads. Like you're going to have more ability to run these ads successfully, which is going to make you more money. And if you think about it, if you really think about it, guys, you're going to invest 2000, 1997 bucks in the Facebook ads course. Right. But if you sell three of the courses, you make your money back. Right. So it's really not that big a deal. It literally pays for itself. But that's what I would say is either read something, figure out how to do this yourself, or I'll just write it for you or else go down and buy the course and I'll teach you how to do this. But anyway, um, you're going to paste in for the URL. You're just going to paste in the URL of your page. Remember guys, this is your page. Now this is yours. So you're just going to send them straight to the page that is yours, right? Right here. So you're going to take this link, whatever this link is, you can change the URL. If you want to put it on your own website, we don't have to talk about that in this video. You're going to change the link and you're going to pop it in right here. Okay. And now you're going to write a headline. Make sure you write a headline and you enter in the newsfeed link description. I'll probably write these all for you guys. So you guys can just pop them in because I want to do this all for you. Um, but it's really not that big a deal. And so once that's all done, you're going to hit confirm. And so then the ad will be ready to go. This is taking forever to upload, but the ad will be ready to go and it will send them to the right places, right? Then once you're getting people there, once you're sending people in, you're actually going to be able to optimize your ad. So let me go back and just show you what this will look like once it's done. Um, let's go to ads manager. I'm going to show you guys really quickly what you're looking for. So what you're looking for here, these aren't exactly the same campaigns, but you get the idea is you're looking for cost per result. Okay. So you're going to set this up. You're going to have a campaign that says, Hey, Facebook ads advertising, right? And it's going to say whatever your cost per result is. And in your case, your, your cost per result is going to say, how much did it cost me to get someone to give me their email address? Right? And so I would try to keep that between one and $2, maybe $3. If you, if you have a bigger budget, but one and $2 to grab someone's email address. Right? And if it's a, if it's higher than that, then you have to adjust who you're targeting and you have to adjust who the ads are going out to. Again, tons more detail about this below. I didn't want to make this like a three hour long video, but, um, you're trying to get your, your basically just looking at this and you're adjusting. So like if I wanted to go in here for this, for example, if I wanted to get this lead cost down, well, this one's more expensive than this one. So I would just pause this one and I would make this one. I would spend more money on this one because it's cheaper. Obviously these are different campaigns, so it's not apples to apples, but I'm just kind of trying to show you guys how this works. And you could do the same thing for Instagram ads. So you would go back through and you would click Instagram as your placement and then you would use that stuff. So I know this might, might seem like it's getting complicated guys, but just stick with me. It's really, really, really not that bad. And so now you have an ad that's sending a bunch of traffic to your landing page, right? So your landing page is here. They're sending, sending traffic to this, right? And people are like, Oh, I'm going to decide to opt in. I'm going to decide not to opt in, whatever. How do you get people? How do you follow up with those people? Right? How do you send them all these emails that I've so lovingly crafted for you? How do you make sure that, and what's the point at, first of all, first of all, what's the point of these emails? You're like, okay, why should I follow up? You should follow up with people because the first time you send them to the webinar, they might not be interested. They might not be ready to purchase, but if you have their email address, you can contact them forever. So just keep sending them emails with your affiliate link in there and they're eventually going to purchase from you. It's, it's going to work out and you're going to make a lot of money. You can set this on autopilot. Okay. So, for sending your emails, you're going to need something which is called an autoresponder. And that will be in the first link in the bio. Everything will be included. You just get your autoresponder and the autoresponder we're going to recommend is called get response. Okay. Get response is affiliate marketing friendly. And the video I did before with, um, drip with hundred to hundred percent affiliate marketing done for you, there was drip was mad about the affiliate marketing. Okay. They didn't want people doing affiliate marketing on their account. They weren't, they weren't letting people do it. Get response is much more friendly for that. So use this platform and it's going to be a free trial. It's no big deal. You don't have to pay for this. Um, 
And so you're going to click that link and get get response. But to hook it up with ClickFunnels, you go over here to manage account, integrations and API, API right here and you're just going to copy this API key, okay? And this isn't complicated, I promise guys, it's not, no big deal. So you copy this API key, you go over back to your page, I got all these pages open, you go back to this page, and then you click on choo -choo -choo, your, little, your little guy up here. You click on this guy, and then you click on integrations right here. So you're gonna integrate this with your with ClickFunnels. So you're gonna hit add new integration, you're gonna type in get response. This is after you've created your account on get response, obviously. Um, I don't know why it's not showing get response. It was there a second ago. There it is, get response. And then you're gonna do integration nickname, just call it um, get response if you want, okay? I already, I already set this up earlier, but um, then you're just gonna paste in that API key and then you'll be good to go right there. So I probably, sh I don't even use get response, we use drip, so it's no big deal that you guys just saw my API key, so oh well. But um, then you come back here to ClickFunnels and now when you're in your little funnel, pick whichever funnel you're working on. We are doing the affiliate Facebook ads funnel. So when you're in here, you just need to hook up your autoresponder to this page so that it's it's transferring people over to Get Response. And before you do this, I forgot this step too, this kind of gets all out of order, but you gotta go over to Get Response and you gotta create a couple of different um, lists. So you're just gonna go to Contacts and then you're gonna go Create List and then you're gonna name the two lists like Amazon FBA and then you're gonna hit Create List and you're gonna do Facebook Ads and then you're gonna create the list, right? And so I created them right here I already created these two lists, so create the two lists first, then go back to the, gosh, all these pages, sorry guys, I keep forgetting which tab I'm in. <laughs> um, and so we're in doo -doo -doo, this page, and so we're gonna click edit page, and then we're gonna go up to settings, we're gonna go to um, integrations, and then we're gonna click select integration, and we're gonna go down to get response, okay? So now in get response, we're going to say add to campaign and we're gonna select a list. So now you pick whichever one you're in. So if you're in the Facebook ads funnel, you click the Facebook ads list. And now every single time someone puts in their email address here, it will send them over to get response, which is fantastic because once they're in get response, you can start sending them these emails that I've already set up for you. So we're on the last step. Are you guys still with me? I'm sorry this is getting complicated. I've, tr I've filmed this video like three times trying to make it less convoluted, but this is what it is. Like this is, you have to set this stuff up and once it's set up, it's fine and it prints you money, but you have to do the work. And if you, I apologize if you watch this video and you're like, oh, this guy's not doing anything. Well, this is what it actually looks like. If someone tells you affiliate marketing is easy and that you don't have to set up anything, you don't have to set up any integrations or any pages, they're idiots. You have to set this stuff up and I'm actually showing you what you should actually do. So I hope that's okay. I'm sorry, I'm just, I'm feeling bad for the people that are confused right now, but I'm also feeling happy for the people that are going to stick with it. Rewind this video like 30 times if you have to to figure this out because it's going to make you so much money, okay? And so we're back here and we have everything, every time someone goes through this page and enters their email address, now it's gonna get sent over to our autoresponder. So we're on the very last step. Now we just have to get the email sequence set up. So what you do is you go up here to, um, you go, I don't use, I, I use Drip, so this is a little weird for me, but you go up to automation and then you go to automation messaging. You guys can't use Drip just to say this, you can't use it for affiliate stuff, okay? And so you're going to create a draft, okay? So create a draft. Now, this is where you enter in all of the stuff that I already gave you. So you go up here, you, you go to the emails. Look, the emails are already done for you. Like email number one. I don't know why it says email number two first here, right here. It should say email number one. <laughs> anyway, email number one, subject line. Did you enjoy the Amazon training? Okay, let's just do the Facebook emails because we're on the Facebook funnel. The Facebook emails are down here, guys. Those are all, all Amazon emails. You guys see, I, I did a lot of this for you. Like, it's crazy. So you take the first email. Did you enjoy the Facebook ads training? Boom. You take that. You go back to get response. You type this into the subject line right here, okay? You can send it, and then you change it to send from your email address. You click next step. Now in next step, you're going to click um, start from scratch and then click blank template, okay? Just trust me, this is going to get through. It's not gonna get stuck in spam filters. You don't need all of that fancy stuff, okay? You're gonna move this text block over here, right here, and now you're going to paste in exactly what I said, okay? So you go down here, you say you take this email address, you take this email just like it is and you go over here and you just paste it in, okay? And so see there's all this stuff that is blank, so you fill in your name. Say your name is Betsy. Hey, I don't know whose name is Betsy out there, but hey, my name is Betsy. Hey, my name is Betsy. I'm that girl 
See, you just customize it. I don't, it's not gonna be the same for everyone who recommended you to that Facebook ads training for my awesome mentors, Kale and Taylor. Any questions I can answer for you? Thanks again for jumping on the training. Betsy, like simple, 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 simple. You could even include a link to a YouTube video here or something like that if you wanted to. You can customize these guys. You don't have to make them all the same. And then you just click next step. Cool, next step. Boom, so that one is ready to go. Did you enjoy the Facebook ads training? Cool. What you're gonna do is get all of the emails in here first. So you just create another draft and we're gonna do this for all of the emails. So it's it, you just literally are going back and forth, copy and pasting. So the next email is this one. You wanna buy a supercar with Facebook ads? The subject line is ready to go. You're just gonna copy this in. You're gonna hit next step and then you're gonna go and do the same template. Okay guys, so start from scratch, blank template and now we just copy this text block over. We take the text. Hey, this is me again. Da, da, da. Okay, cool. So I literally am just gonna copy this and then I'm gonna read through it and make sure that it makes sense. Okay, so copy it over. You're gonna copy it here. All right, so we add it in here. It's not gonna let me copy it again. Oh, there it goes. Okay, so I copied it in here. This is a little weird for me, guys, because I, like I said, I used Drip, but you guys will get used to Git response. It's no big deal. So you copy it in and then you change the name to this is me again me, um, Dave again, whatever. And then you're gonna go through this stuff and then you're gonna make sure all the links work. So you just copy the link, hit copy, go up here and click the link and then paste that in twice. Okay, so the links work, that mean, makes the link clickable. Um, and then I don't know why I copied in twice here. And then whenever I, whenever I say, I already have this done for you guys, but it says insert whatever links you want. So insert your link to the ClickFunnels webinar page. So the link to your ClickFunnels webinar page, that just means you go back to your ClickFunnels account where you have this funnel built right here. This funnel is already built. And then you just go up here, you make, you make this link, you copy this link, and then you pop it in over here on this email that we're building right here. So you replace this with your link, right? So there you go, it's gonna send them back to that training. And then you just make sure that the link works and you click here and you do that, okay? So the link is working and now you just click next step. Okay, so I just set up two emails like real quickly. It says my template's empty. Whatever, I don't know what's wrong with this. I, it was like giving me some error message earlier, but I'll just go back to the top. So it's all good. So we have this draft, we have this one email. I, I can make it work. I can show you guys how to set up this automation with this one email ready to go. So all you do is you go to automations right here again, and then you go down here and you say, start your first workflow. Okay, so a workflow is just a sequence of emails that you're gonna send. You're gonna set this up one time and then you're never gonna have to set it up again, which is the best part, right? So you just click start now, build from scratch, start now. And so as it's as you're building this, just like, like give yourself some slack, it's really not that hard. Okay, and so you're gonna do, the first one is start this process when someone subscribes, right? When someone subscribes to your list. So this is say, saying subscribe to any list via any method, which is a little bit annoying. You wanna, you wanna segment these people out. You wanna send them different emails if they sign up for Amazon FBA or different emails if they sign up for Facebook ads, right? So you're just gonna click on this properties over here, select the list, change it to specific, select the list, change it to whichever list you're talking about. So Facebook ads, right? Now you're going to take this and you're going to send a message. So you just drag in a message, you're sending a message, and you drag the little thing to say, boom, I wanna send a message after they do this, okay? And so to change the message, you just go down here to drafts, and you select the message that you wanna send. So maybe you wanna send that the first one first, which you should send them in the same order that I gave them to you. So you just, call, you just select the message that you wanna send, right? Um, did you enjoy the Facebook ads training? You click okay, and boom, there it goes. And so now this is really easy, guys. It makes it easy to build. So now you're just gonna drag Another thing, so what you wanna do is wait 24 hours in between emails, right? So you're just gonna say, hey, wait, wait a second, send it to wait, and then say, wait one day, and then you're gonna send another message, and that next message will be the next message in the sequence. Super, super simple, right? If I could get this to work, there we go. Super easy, and you can change this message to whatever you wanna send next, right? So you go down to drafts, you select a message, you wanna buy a supercar, Boom, okay, so there it goes. And you can actually see where your people are going, which is really helpful for email marketing. If you wanna get more advanced with this, I could definitely talk, to, talk your ear off about it, but like cool things you could do is like, if you, if you upgrade this, obviously we use Drip, so we don't use this, but if you upgrade Get Response, you can say, hey, if they visit a URL, I can treat them differently, right? So what you could do is you could segment this out. It's not gonna let me here because I have to upgrade, but um, what you could do is click this visit, visited URL page and put that in between here. 
And then if they don't visit the URL that you want them to go to, then you can resend them the same email, right? So you segment people based on if they're doing what you want. That way you get them to go where you want, you, you pause and you wait until they do what you want and then you continue down the cycle, which is a more advanced thing, but that's, I just wanted to throw that in for you. So that's really it guys. You just build out the whole email sequence, you hit save and publish, and then it literally runs on autopilot. Like it's crazy. Autopilot, the whole thing, guys. You go into Facebook ads, you have this ad set up, this ad is running, this ad is getting people to this page. They go to the page, they give you their email address. They immediately get sold something. They immediately come to this page and they're like, oh my gosh, um, maybe I should buy this product. Maybe I should buy this, maybe I should do it. They click your link, because your affiliate link is already in there, they click this link, they go and they buy it. A certain percentage of them buy it. Those that don't buy it are already over here in your email sequence. They've subscribed to your email list. You have their email forever. You can always email them. You can always update them. And then they're going through this sequence that I've already built for you that I already know works. And that sequence is going to make you money on the back end, down the line from people that weren't ready to buy right away. So I hope you can see how super, 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 super valuable this is, guys. I'm going to put everything in the first link in the bio. So if you click the first link in the bio, it's going to take you to a page. You enter your email address in and then I'm going to send you literally everything in this document. I'm talking like everything and I'm going to add some stuff at the top. So I'm going to add in the ClickFunnels funnel that you need. I'm going to add in where you, your Get Response free trial, all that stuff that you need. I'm going to add in any copy for the ads that you need if I have a chance to write the copy. So it's all literally 100%, 110% done for you affiliate marketing. So if you enjoy this, if you think this is valuable, if you think that, oh my gosh, I've never seen a YouTube video where a YouTube guru gave away so much stuff in one, I mean, I'm giving you a 19 page document um, of free emails for you to make money. I'm giving you 31% of our company. I'm giving you the landing pages, the everything you need. I know it seems complicated, but if you want to be an advanced marketer that makes six figures, seven figures doing this, then you need all of these things that I've showed you. So this is affiliate marketing, 110% done for you. If you liked it, share it. If you haven't hit subscribe, what the hell are you doing? I will see you guys in the next one.